Hi everyone, it's Sarah or Lovely Day here with another video. It's been a while since I've filmed in this room. I honestly forgot how I set it up. I know the echoing is not ideal. That is one thing that my office had over this space is that the audio was better. Apologies about that. Hopefully I'll find a solution for it soon. But in the meantime, I am happy to be back here with my dolls behind me on the shelf. Today I'm going to be opening this insanely massive parcel from Kayla. I've gotten to know Kayla over the past few months over on Twitch and in my Discord and she is just so so kind and when she offered to send something to my PO box I couldn't say no but I was not expecting this. This is insane. This is huge. Kayla, I, I don't know what I did to deserve this but I'm really excited to open it. To all of you watching, I will put a link to Kayla's Instagram in the description below. She has a smart doll Mirai and has named her Honey. She is adorable. I am of course biased to the name because, well, me. <laughs> but she's gorgeous. Kayla's gorgeous and I really recommend checking her out. Kayla's covered it in some adorable stickers which is such a sweet touch. As you might be able to notice, the top of the box is slightly squashed, but I'm sure everything in there will be fine. Enough talking though, let's get it open. I have no idea what is in here. Kayla said something about sending some props, so uh, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Oh my gosh. So you guys can see. Look at this thing. Kayla, it's beautiful. Oh my God. I don't want to take off the bow. It's too pretty. It's so, so cute. Oh my gosh, look at the little hinges, the little doorknobs. There's this little thing on it here, which you turn to the side to unlock the doors. It's packed in here. What the frag, Kayla? Are you guys seeing this? Look in there. <laughs> this one says handmade by me. It's got a little pineapple on it. It looks like it's a corset, perhaps. Oh my gosh. You made this, Kayla? Yeah, it's definitely a corset. Wow, I love the colors. Wait, is there something else inside here? What? Kayla, you're so clever. How did you make this? It has Velcro at the back. And then the doll can wear the corset with it. Oh my gosh. Kayla! Kayla, I can't! <laughs> At the top here, it looks like we have some little cushions as well. Oh my gosh, they are adorable! <laughs> Kayla, did you make these too? Because they are way too sweet. I love them. I'm just gonna put them up there. Gosh, how many are there? You've really jammed this full of things. Um, hmm. Oh, I see. Is this a card? No, it's not a card, it's lots of little stickers. There are a bunch of teeny stickers. They are all pastel pink and blue and they are adorable. This one here says for Ava on it. Ava's just behind me up there. I, I have to open this one next. I should probably bring Ava down actually before I open it properly. Okay, that's better. She's still on her phone, quite the antisocial one at the moment, but we'll just get her to put it down for now while we open this up. Kayla, look, it'll be perfect for her too. I'm gonna have to put this on her as soon as I can. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to try all of these things on in this video, but I'll definitely have to do some sort of dress up really, really soon. Next, we have this little yellow dress. It will look so good alongside B, who also has things yellow like this. It looks like it has little bees on it. I'm not sure if they are bees, but they look like bees. They're really, really cute. We have a little vest. This is way too sweet. It's got the Glitter Girls tag in there, so I know it's going to fit her. Oh my gosh. 
these are also glitter girls i've seen these but i was never able to get them i really really hope they fit her she has got wider hips but this actually looks like it's wider so i'm hopeful next thing for ava is this little bunny dress very very cute i love the print and we also have a skirt oh my gosh kayla you have spoiled ava completely rotten and there's still more i can't i'm gonna grab this one next it's also on the top shelf it's a bit heavier and it says young and sweet on it perhaps it's some snacks we'll have to wait and see oh my gosh it is snacks <laughs> what there are a bunch of food props and they're plastic, but they've got quite a significant weight to them. They're really nicely made. They have a lot of detail. I'm not sure how well you can see them, but they are so cool. We've got some ice cream. We've got a burger. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Uh, more ice cream, another burger, a cake. We also have, is this a crepe? Am I an idiot? I don't know, I think it's a crepe. <laughs> and we have a biscuit. These are super cool. I really should get on to doing more with my diorama. These would look great in it. There's only one more thing on the top shelf and it looks like it is a bag. It feels like there's something in it too. So let's open it up. <gasps> what? Are these the little shops? Oh my gosh, I've seen these, but I've never been able to get any of them. Gosh, or are these the five surprise ones? I don't know, but they are way too cute. We've got some really small warheads, two mini jars of Mentos, a couple of drinks with whipped cream on top, and I'm pretty sure this is a little thing of shaving cream, unless I'm mistaken. I've always been on the lookout for the five surprise mini brands, but they never came to New Zealand, so... This is awesome that you've seen some to me, thank you. And now that I've opened the bag and emptied it out, I can see that it is in fact an Our Generation bag, which explains why it is so perfect in scale. I'm gonna grab this next. It looks like a little shopping basket. <gasps> what? How did you get this? Where? I didn't even know these existed. This is way too perfect. It's a little Walmart shopping basket. This is too perfect. I had no idea these existed. This is so cool. And is even more excited? I can't. Kayla. Oh my god. Okay. Are you guys seeing this? How perfect is that? And there's another one too. You've spoiled me too much. In here also, we've got some little books. Let's bring them all out at once and go through. We have The Lovely Bones, The Fault in Our Stars. They have backs to them too. I forgot to show you the one for The Lovely Bones, but they're so detailed. We have Fangirl, which also has the full cover with the back and everything. And last but not least, The Perks of Being a Wallflower. I've always wanted to try and make little copies of books that I own and these have really given me insight as to how I might do that. So thank you, Kayla. There's one more thing in this cupboard compartment and that is this here. Is this a blanket? It is. Oh my gosh. It's actually really soft. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. It'll be absolutely perfect for the bed that I made. And somehow we're not even done. There's a drawer at the bottom. Let's just open it and have a look. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, it's so cute. Ava's gonna love this. I would give it to her now, but she's kind of got her hands full at the moment. And the other things in here are teeny little bento boxes. They're both different colors and have different things on them and I think they're made of the same plastic as the other food props so they're really nicely made, they've got a good weight to them, they're really really cool. I really don't know what to say. Kayla, thank you so so much for sending all of these awesome things to me. I really don't know what I did to deserve it all but I really appreciate it, thank you so so much. 
for all of you guys watching could please go visit Kayla's Instagram. I would really love that. It's the least I can do after she has shown me so much kindness. I can't wait to try all of these things out, to try the clothes on B, or perhaps this would work nicely on Heather, who knows. I'm really excited to just give it a go. And all of the things that Ava's got there too, I'm sure she will look adorable. Not to mention all of the awesome props. And this wardrobe, I seriously cannot, like, where did you find something like that? It is so perfect. I'm gonna put it in my diorama straight after this and just play with it, honestly. I really wish I wasn't going out tonight, otherwise I know what I would be doing for the rest of my weekend. But that brings me to the end of this video. I do hope you enjoyed it, I certainly did. If you did, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below telling me what you think. Perhaps you could share with me your favorite item from this insane parcel. If you're not already subscribed, I would love it if you joined me here. I upload a new video every weekend. Thank you so much for watching. It has been lovely and I'll catch you in another video sometime soon.